Let's define the sine and the cosine. Let's say that you have some angle V, we'll call it. We've seen that an angle can be used to define a point on the unit circle. If you take the x-axis as one ray forming the angle, and you form an angle V, that uniquely determines a point on the unit circle. And we're going to use this relationship to define two functions. The cosine of V is going to be the X coordinate of this point. And the sine of V is going to be the Y coordinate of this point. So when you write these down, they're abbreviated cos and sin, but let me write down the full names of the functions as well the cosine and the sine.